Hello folks. Yeah, back at the holster build there now. Uh, this is what I come up with. Over like this. This one here will go like that there. And on the inside, solder broid belt there. And this here is going to be wrapped around there. Yeah, now I can do some stamping and this stuff on it. Uh, this here is the leather I'm using is nine ounce leather and I got some uh, sheepskin two ounce one ounce two ounce so it's gonna be layered inside of there so you have a few smooth finish put the gun in and probably look a bit better in a hairy back one or something anyhow guys uh, this is my first step I'm gonna cut it out now and uh, every step now I'll throw a little video on it and Hope you like it, take it on, and to Wallace's new adventure, making a gun holster. Right on. Back in there now. I got some of the stamping on air. I got this the border to go around aired on. What I'm gonna do, plan on doing is this one there is gonna be looped, sold, and then sold to the back. And this part here uh, be sliding down in her. Uh, I guess it's a Mexican style uh, holster. Yeah. Bit of stamp there to do, so I'm going to carry on at that now and uh, give you another look when it's done. Uh, good morning, folks. Yeah. Back at me, letter uh, holster there now. You can see I have two, two layers of dye put on that one, that side, one on this side. Be pretty well all my holes drilled. So I want to get that dyed before I uh, saw in. And I got my uh, Ulster molded pretty well. Yeah, so now I got to go now and finish drilling the holes and sewing this part in. Then I'm putting me well, put that in. Yeah, because if not, I won't get my needle in through, you know, sewing in around there and that. So I'm going to get that there finished first there now, sewed in. This here is going to take me a bit of time. And i got to put another two layers of dye on it. So it's going to take another, you know. So, you know, guys. Uh, Next step now is to put one more layer of dye on this one, two on this one, sew it in, get me well put in, clamp glued, drilled through there, and mold it for the gun. And this here got to be tip dude. Yeah, I'll tell you, yeah, that's going to take a little while there now, so I'll uh, get back to you in a little bit. As you can see there now, she's starting to come together. I got the welt put in and just gluing in there now. Uh, this stitch, this is stitched and up around there. Now I got to do the back after and put her together. So that's the next step there now. And uh, I'm gonna try to get this one aired on now. On and after, so. Yeah, so I'll get back to you in not a little while. Back in there, folks. Is the gun that I was talking about? Well, not actually. That's how to show you this gun there. This is another one of my kids' guns. Yeah. It's one I had when I was a young fella, about six year old, I suppose. He's about 42 year old now, I guess. Yeah. Take a little cap. No, he broke there now, but well, and he just jams up on the side, flick, bang. Yeah, guys, I'm gonna make a holster for that one of these years to go with the job that I got done here. There we go. As you can see, I got my holster done. Turned out pretty good. Yeah. 
Uh, this one there, uh, put an extra coat or two on this one to darken it up a little more than the background there. There you go, guys. Have another look at her. A lot of work. Took me over two weeks to get her all done. The belt and uh, and the ulster there. A lot of sewing. I say five, close to eight hours of sewing. Steady sewing, that is. Yeah, so tell me what things are there, guys. And got the leg straps on her. The, there for so you don't pop out. It's a bit tight there now, but it'll work in. Well, it's only going to be a wall hanger, so really, I don't want to pop out too easy. Yeah, I'll complete it. Good job. Hey anyway, guys, that's me, um, Colt 45 holster. Well, yeah. Well, I'll get back to you in a second there. Now well, I'm going to stick an eye on the pill, give you another look. Back in there, folks. This is the bullet loops. Short ones there, that's the ones that you put the caps in. Long ones, just the dummy ones. I think I showed you that before. And you go down there, and it's the yeah done believe it job I always wanted to do wanted to have yeah so uh that's it for this video hope you enjoyed it give me a thumbs up please subscribe and all that good stuff and uh have a great weekend we'll see you on the next one